This is a one minute journal club. This is not medical advice. Read these data for yourself. Should we provide our DKA patients with bicarb to fix their pH? We wanna correct their acidosis faster. We wanna make the numbers pretty, but does this actually work? The first thing people forget is that bicarb is metabolized into CO2. If the patient is already huffing and puffing, Providing them with bicarb is likely going to make their work of breathing harder. A systematic review was published in 2011 looking at DKA patients and bicarb. These patients had a mean pH of less than 7.05. And guess what? The bicarb did not help. More recently, this study looked at 80-something patients with a pH of less than 6.9 retrospectively, the very sick patients. Did the bicarb help here? Nope. A 2018 review in a diabetes journal looked through all the data and they confirmed what I just said. There's no benefit to giving people bicarb and DKA. If your patient has like threatening hyperkalemia based on these data you may have a point since we're not going to improve outcomes with bicarb why are we even checking abgs and bbgs in our patients stop doing that